TPO mechanically attached systems. Mechanically attached is the most common TPO roofing system installed. Basic attachment is accomplished by installing plates and fasteners through the membrane in the seams. Mechanically attached systems work best in decks that are conducive to mechanical fasteners, such as wood and steel. Other decks, such as concrete, gypsum, or cementitious wood fiber are not ideal candidates for mechanically attached roofing system due to the cost of specialized fasteners and the additional labor to install them. The most efficient way to improve uplift resistance is to install additional rows of fasteners or use narrower sheets. As wind passes over a building, all roofs experience higher pressure in the perimeter and corners. Enhancements to the roof design are required in these areas to compensate for the additional uplift forces. Building height, roof area dimensions, design wind speed, roof slope, parapet height, and surrounding topography all affect the uplift pressures exerted on a roof. Refer to the appropriate Muleheide mechanically attached specification for perimeter enhancement and fastening requirements. Install any required insulation or coverboard. Watch our insulation mechanically attached video for instructions. Prior to installing the membrane, ensure that the work area is clean and dry. All debris must be removed from the area to be covered. Install the required perimeter enhancements. Perimeter enhancement can be accomplished by using perimeter half sheets or 10 inch ruts. When utilizing perimeter half sheets, be sure to use the correct width sheet for the field sheets being installed. Eight foot wide field sheets use four foot perimeter sheets. 10 foot and 12 foot wide field sheets require six foot perimeter sheets. When installing 10 inch rust, set the rust at the midpoint of the outside field sheet. In this video, we will be demonstrating perimeter half sheets. If installing a mechanically attached TPO roofing system over a steel deck, Perimeter half sheets are only installed along the perimeter edges that run perpendicular to the ribs of the deck. The other two sides are completed by installing fingers or fasteners located in the center of each field sheet. In this video, we are installing the system over a wood deck. Install the perimeter half sheets parallel to all exterior edges. Rolling out perimeter half sheets is similar to laying out a picture frame. Roll out the perimeter half sheets and allow to relax for 15 to 30 minutes. The colder the weather, the longer it should relax. Start the first sheet tight to the base of the wall on one end, but stop short of the wall on the other end. Be sure the sheet will be long enough to extend under the next sheet a minimum of six inches. Install the remaining sheets in the same manner. There is no need to extend both sheets to the outside edge in the corners. Doing this would create two layers of membrane in the corners. Repeat this process until the required number of perimeter half sheets are installed. Fill in the rest of the roof with full width field sheets. All TPO sheets have one side that is printed. The solid line is located five and a half inches away from the edge and is used as a guide when rolling out subsequent rolls. The X's are printed six inches on center and are there to help with fastener placement. When the plates are set on top of the X, the five and a half inch wide seam will provide the required minimum one and a half inch wide hot air weld. TPO sheet must be fastened with barbed 2.4 inch seam plates and number 14 HD or number 15 EHD fasteners. Once the sheets have been set and allowed to relax, fold back the seams and install the seam plates and fasteners as required. Fasteners and spacing are determined by the uplift requirements of the project. All TPO seams must be hot air welded. Mulehide requires that an automatic welder be used on all jobs requiring a system warranty. Be sure the top sheet is set and the seam area is clean before welding. Dust and other contaminants can be removed with weathered membrane cleaner. TPO welds differently depending on the weather conditions. As a starting point, set the automatic welder at 1000 degrees Fahrenheit and 12.5 feet per minute. Always run test welds on scrap material to ensure an adequate weld. Adjust the setting to provide maximum productivity while still maintaining a proper weld. Things to remember. Mechanically attached systems work best in decks that are conducive to mechanical fasteners, such as wood and steel. The most efficient way to improve uplift resistance is to install additional rows of fasteners or use narrower sheets. All mechanically attached roofing systems require perimeter enhancement. Perimeter enhancement can be accomplished by using perimeter half sheets or 10-inch rusts. 
On projects with a steel deck, perimeter enhancement fingers are required along the edges that run parallel to the deck ribs. All mechanically attached seams must be a minimum of five and a half inches wide. Mulehide requires the use of an automatic welder on all jobs requiring a system warranty.